My hair is super dry. My scalp is extremely dry. Sometimes we all wonder how to care for a natural hair whilst it's still braided. And that's exactly what I'm going to show you in today's video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use clothes water and clothes batter to moisturize your hair whilst it's still braided. And you know how we do it here. Give this video a thumbs up and leave me a lovely comment. Let's get into the recipe. Okay, so I do not braid my edges whenever I do my braids. And this is how my hair was looking when I first did it. I left my edges to breathe. Girl, if you are braiding your edges like so, you are killing your hair. Make sure you do not braid your edges whenever you braid your hair. Let's go into the recipe. So I start by adding some clothes to a saucepan. I add some water. Then I put it on the fire to boil it for about 10 minutes. If you've been following me on this channel, you know how to prepare clothes water by now. And this is my clothes water. After that, I transfer into a spray bottle using a funnel and this is how your clothes water should look like the color should be popping clothes are very potent and little clothes seeds will give you a lot of clothes water of course i add some olive oil to help prevent the dryness clothes can also prevent dandruff as well as olive oil and of course i love my lavender oil due to the fragrance and also the strength that it adds to my hair and this is another secret you can add your leave-in condition to this mixture and today i'm using my tgin leave-in conditioner and guys i have all the links to all these products in my description box make sure to check it out and you can purchase these on amazon using my amazon links it does not cost any extra cost to you but i get a little commission whenever you use my amazon links to purchase anything from amazon so this is how my scalp is all looking dry girl that hair needs some love and hey show me some love by giving this video a thumbs up and if you are new here do not forget to subscribe and click on the bell for more videos i do a lot of diys that can help you grow your hair as well as hair creatives join us you're gonna love it so this is how my hair is looking i start by spraying the water to every part of it remember the benefits of closed water closed water can prevent premature growing of hair it can help prevent dandruff it helps moisturize your hair and all the combinations with the oil the leave-in condition and everything together girl you work this on your roots on your natural hair you are good to go so whenever you spray it in make sure you are massaging it in you are getting it into the roots massage it girl just get it in <laughs> every part of it the back part the front part all corners and you have any problems in your head this is the best time to make sure you are getting that close water into it i have so many videos on close water and how to use them and girl if you have tried clove water i would love to hear from you in the comment section i love clothes because clothes have helped me grow my hair ever since i did my big chop then after spraying the water all over making sure getting it to the edges and all your natural hair then i go in with my clothes batter this batter is everything i cannot even start talking about clothes batter guys it does a whole lot for my hair it can help prevent dandruff it can help you grow your hair much faster and remember healthy scalp means healthy hair because new hair always grows from the scalp so once you're treating your scalp your roots every part of your hair then you are guaranteed of healthy hair and this is how my hair is looking look at that just look at that it's all moisturized look at that just compare the before and the after of this hair. My hair is all moisturized and I do this like once every week. Whenever I feel my hair or my scalp is dried, I do this. Then at this point, I just leave my hair to air dry. Guys, you have to make sure that hair is air dried. You do this whenever you do not have any appointments or you are home, you let it dry. And after it's all dried, I put it back in a ponytail. And whenever I'm ready to step out, I just grab my hard brush and just brush it up. Look at that, guys. Just look at how moisturized, how beautiful and shining my natural hair is looking. I braided my hair, but I'm still taking care of my natural hair. And you should do the same. Whenever you braid your hair, do not leave your hair, but rather care for your hair before you take out the braids. And this is how it's looking and how do you like it, guys? I hope you have already given this video a thumbs up. And if you are new here, I know you have subscribed. See you at my next video. Bye.